Today started out pretty normal. I woke up Clover and took her for her morning walk. It's time to get my oil changed. I'm going to be driving about 1,200 miles over the next couple of days. I put a lot of miles on my Jeep, and so I tend to get my oil changed every month or two anyways. I like to use Valvoline. They usually have a group on, and there's usually locations throughout the country that are within easy access for me. I drove into town and got my shower at Planet Fitness. I stopped into Coffee Rush one last time. Today I got a white chocolate raspberry latte, and then I made a sandwich. I like to use my skillet to warm up the sandwich, so I will cut the bagel into four. And I'll also cut my cheese slice into four as well. This morning I grabbed a Brussels sprout. One single Brussels sprout at the grocery store is usually about 24 to 25 cents. So it's a cheap way to just get a little bit of green into your diet if you aren't wanting to eat a whole salad. So I just kind of assembled my sandwich and put it on the skillet. Overall, the whole sandwich cost about less than $3 to make. And it really hit the spot this morning. After breakfast, I got right to door dashing. This morning, there was an extra $2 bonus for every delivery in Chandler, so I went ahead and decided to make a little extra money before I got my oil changed. Overall, it was a pretty easy morning. After I finished with the deliveries, I took Clover for a walk and I made a cup of tea. Next up, I stopped into Valvoline for the oil change. Of course, when they do that, they check my tire pressure, refill my washer fluid, and I had them test my battery today, and everything looked good to go for my drive. Originally, I was going to leave tomorrow, but since the oil oil change went smooth. I decided just to go ahead and start the drive this afternoon. So I stopped into the grocery store for some last minute supplies and snacks. I got Clover a couple of pieces of turkey and I got myself a wellness shot. My energy has been a little low the last couple of days so I figured it couldn't hurt. And I've had a couple of these now so it's getting easier to drink. And then we were off. I'm heading to Kansas City to go visit my sister and cat sit while she goes on vacation. I decided I could do about three to four hundred miles today. Looking at the map I saw that there is a rest area outside of Albuquerque which would be 388 miles. The drive was absolutely beautiful. I haven't actually seen snow in probably a couple of years so it was cool to be able to let Clover run around in it. It was really hard to leave. This was Tonto Forest and there are a dozen different things that I have bookmarked to do here and I haven't done any of them so on the way back when we go to visit Arizona next year I definitely want to spend more time at Tonto forest and of course i think clover really enjoyed it here as well it was hard to make good time i wanted to stop every five minutes and look at stuff for lunch i just had some bone broth at about five o'clock i made it to a rest area in salt river canyon this whole area was gorgeous i was able to take clover for a walk down by the river and I was actually tempted to stay here for the night. There's a lot of trails here and a waterfall, so it's on the list for next year to come here and stay the night for a couple of nights. I felt like I had a couple of more hours left in me though, so we decided to push forward. Usually when we're traveling, I'm not in a rush, but this time I had a destination and I was eager to get to Kansas City to see my sister and my nieces. Driving through the winding roads took a little bit longer than I thought it would. Along the highway, there are a lot of gravel pull-off areas. Here and there, from time to time, you'll see a car or a semi pulled off and parked in these gravel spots. So when I got tired, I just pulled off into one of these gravel spots and parked next to this bush for the night. I was still about an hour away from the rest area that I had intended to stay at, but it was a long day and I was getting tired, so I decided that this was as good of a spot as any. In total, I drove through 302 miles. I stopped once for gas, which was $25.22. I ended the day with half a tank, and that's it. I'll see you tomorrow.